Alright, what's going on everybody? It's Tristan and today, as you guys can see, I'm already here with the screen recording and I did lie. Yes, I am going to actually be posting a video today and I'll have one there tomorrow for you all. Just stay tuned. Uh, I got a really dope one there tomorrow. You might be able to see I got, uh, I kind of fixed it I think, but I literally have a shadow from these shoes I have stacked that I'm going to be showing you all in the vid tomorrow. So again, very, very excited to do that video. Just kind of wanted to mention that video is going to be coming. So just stay tuned on the channel for whenever that's going to be posted. Might take me a bit to edit, but I'll try and get it through. But that's completely off topic. We we're discussing how you guys can cop the Women's Air Jordan 11 Low, the Citrus, the Bright Citrus colorway. So we'll hop straight into that. If you want to check my Instagrams again, anything like that down below. Uh, more content like this, then again, you can subscribe and like, and any, anything like my socials and all that are down by the description if you want to, you know, go so, uh, support by in any of those ways. But again, let's get into how to cop this shoe. So first things first, we'll discuss the date and time, everything, you know, when this one's dropping. So the retail is $185 and this will be worth it to pay. So, you know, just make sure you have the money ready. Uh, and then it's dropping May 6th at 10 a.m. Eastern time. So it's going to be, you know, three hours earlier again, West Coast. I always try and mention that every video. So you all just kind of remember that. But you will be getting up a little bit earlier if you over there for that drop. But yeah, just stay tuned. May 6th, 10 a.m. Nothing really out of the ordinary there with the time. Uh, and, you know, again, the name fits for this shoe. I mean, it's, you know, citrus. So, I mean, orange, that kind of fits. And, uh, you know, you got, it's pretty, it's a pretty sleek design. I'd say, you know, uh, Jordan 11s have always been a pretty easy shoe to wear. Uh, but also, you know, it's like an easy shoe to clean. All, all around, the shoe is good. Uh, and it's going to resell well but for that reason. If you are trying to get it to resale, I understand if you're just trying to get the shoe to wear. You know, there's po probably more people that are actually trying to do that. But, I mean, who knows? Uh, I mean, I think there'll be plenty of people trying to resell this one too. But, I mean, the market's pretty good on this one. We'll get into discussing that. I'm getting a little off topic discussing that a little earlier. Uh, but, yeah, again, women's sizing only. Only goes up to the size 12W, which means that if you're a guy trying to wear the shoe, uh, so let's say me, for example, uh, I wear a size 10. That means I would have to go cop a size 11 and a half of this shoe if I wanted to wear it. Now, uh, and that's because, you know, again, the women's sizing, it's a size and a half down compared to uh, men's. So, you know, again. If you're if you're like a size 12 in men's, you're not gonna be able to fit into this shoe because the 12 W is not a 12 men's. You uh, it's just, you have to have a 13 and a half uh, in women's for you to even wear this if you're a size 12. So sorry to all my boys with big feet out there. You you are taking the L on this drop unless you're trying to resell it. But uh, yeah, if you're trying to wear this one, just no, that ain't, that ain't happening. No chief. Uh, I'm sorry about that. You try another day. But uh, yeah, for now at least this one is women's sizing only. Uh, and that's just, you know, how it is. So, uh, aside from that, no grade school, none of that. You know, I like how the shoe looks. We got some other pictures. They're clean. And yeah, that's that's really all I have to say about the first details on it. So, let's just get into reselling this one because I know some of you are probably here for that and you want to know what I'm kind of thinking these ones will resell for. And I do think this is actually a good shoe to cop. The market's looking pretty good for it. I mean, I think, you know, Jordan 11 Low, I mean, easy shoe to wear. Good shoe, you know, for going into the summer. I mean, they're dropping this right at the right time. May, you know, everybody's on the shoe releases right now. People have been going crazy. Uh, like just, you know, like college classes just got off for some places. I mean, yeah, you know, you notice I'm back home, my first video back home. So, you know, I'm, I'm happy about that. So, I'll, you know, there's a lot of good things uh, about the shoe and when it is dropping. So kind of looking at the market right now, it's like 270, 280. I mean, it's they're pretty much everyone's selling around 270, 280. That's just, you know, where they're at. And I personally think once they all drop on sneakers in the next, you know, five days, you know, five days, you know, today's first. I don't know why I'm explaining every little thing. I guess there's a little thing I do, you know, in some of my videos, uh, just to, you know, have some clarity. But yeah, I personally think these ones are going to drop another 20, 30 bucks. I think these ones are going to be going for right around a range of like 240 to 260. That's, that's what I'm going to say, 240 to 260. And I'm not going to put a plus because I a, do think that they could drop lower than 240. I think that's actually probably the more likely option. And I don't think they're going to rise once more pairs drop. I mean, maybe this shoe will rise over time. I will keep an eye on it. But I mean, I'm, I'm for, for now, at least uh just you know get it flip it that's what i would say if you are just trying to get it to resell uh you know your boy has been taking a massive sneakers l streak but uh you know he's been having success in the foot site so you know i'll, I'll take that and i'll show you all the other places where the shoe uh will drop in this video aside from you know just uh sneakers i mean i'll make sure to you know mention all the places but yeah that's just kind of my resale estimation i mean you look at the chart i mean it's, it's dropping but i mean it's not really dropping that slowly just a little it seems like 10 10 dollars a day right now so i mean if it does drop let's say uh you know another you know ten dollars a day over the next five days and that's already out of my resale range so again the shoe could you know i think it's gonna be worth it to pay you know you will make a little bit of money on it it's not like a crazy profit shoe you know but uh after like you know shipping and after like taxes on the retail and all that it, you'll, you'll be making money so don't worry about that so aside from that i'm gonna actually be showing you all uh, a direct method on how to cop uh this shoe like different sneakers like this off uh the sneakers app 
being a little repetitive uh, with the word right there, but I'm gonna link this video down below and some of you all already probably know what this is. This video right here is a how to cop uh, on sneakers video and it basically shows you all uh, all the details and how you guys can make multiple accounts on sneakers. And I just kind of wanted to you know, make sure I directed you all to this. It'll be there in the description. And I pretty much run through like this notepad right here in the video, uh, kind of like different important things that you should do, uh, you know, check out faster on sneakers, you know, how to, you know, like, uh, like what what methods are faster and like, you know, again, just different payment methods, jigging your address, making multiple accounts. It's all discussed in the video. So if y'all want to go check that out, if you haven't already, that'll be there. And again, we just kind of run through this notepad right here to kind of explain what I do to at least cop off sneakers. But you know, your boy's been on the L streak. Sneakers st is still random, but of course you can do different things to increase your chances by, you know, making more accounts because four chances is better than one chance. So I explain it in that one. So aside from that, uh, I'm actually going to be showing you all, uh, a cook group that can actually help cop a release just like this one for you all since this one I is going to be dropping on foot sites. I want to show you all my go-to cook group. I'm going to give a huge shout out to my guys at Secret Sauce right here. I've always, you know, shown love to them right here and they are a $60 monthly fee, but what they can do is they can actually help you guys cop releases just like this one that drop on tons of foot sites since this release is going to be dropping not just on sneakers. There's tons of other um, you know, different locations that are going to be having the shoe dropping that are online. So, you know, again, a group like this could actually be really essential since they actually provide this thing called slots for their members, which basically, um, you know, if you enter in it just in time, you know, they have like a, you know, I think it's like a limited amount, uh, usually because, you know, you can only have, you know, run for so many people. But if you enter in the slot on time, uh, basically what they do is that they, uh, all you got to do is they have these Google forms, uh, and it kind of shows you all like what the Google form will be running for, like what release, like, Hey, this Google form, uh, that slot, you know, is, is going to be running for, you know, the Jordan 11 low citrus of this release, or, you know, for another release, like the hyper Royals, uni blues, uh, they actually caught me some of the uni blues. So shout out them. But what they do is that in the Google form, you just put your shipping and payment info and then they, uh, you know, put it in their bots and then cop releases for you. And it's hundred percent safe. Again, I've done this. I still do this, you know, every week, pretty much whenever there's a release that's pretty much, uh, you know, just worth the money to cop. And yeah, they help me get releases. They don't take any info or anything. Again, it is 100% safe. You guys can trust me on that. They do not uh, take your info on anything. That's not really, uh, you know, what they're about. And you know, that everybody in that like run uh, the bots for the, you know, group is trusted and they're 100% uh, safe. And don't forget this group chat, it's not just about shoes. You can make money uh, tons of other ways. I mean, there's like stocks in the chat, you know, you can like, they got really good people talking about stocks to invest in, but you know, you can like trade NFTs. I've, I've mentioned that in the past few videos that, you know, the top shot hype, you know, the Pokemon, everything is going down in here if you're trying to make some money. So you shout out my guys at Secret Sauce. And if you're interested in joining the group, just send them a message on Twitter and be like, yo, Tristan sent me, how could I get into the group? Or, you know, just follow them on Instagram and wait until they drop some more invites and go enter, you know, there, but yeah, you can just send them a message there if you want to try and enter that way. And they're exclusive, so they don't let everybody in, but you know, hopefully they let my boys in right here or girls. We're inclusive, we're inclusive here. You know, we got, we got an audience here, you know, I don't know what I'm going on about <laughs> really, but uh, aside from that, actually, I'm also going to be showing you all again, I'll be linking this sneaker news article and also this house of heat article kind of shows you all again, all of the different raffle places, uh, which don't forget raffles are worth it to enter to uh, enter in, enter to uh, enter in. Uh, and yeah, just again, shows you all, all those places that are going to be, you know, having, you know, those releases, those different foot site drops. Sneaker News isn't really showing any of them, but yeah, shout out House of Heat. They kind of show you all like finish line, Jetty Sports, all those typical places. Make sure you check the, the foot apps too, you know, again, uh, you know, like the finish line app, all those different ones, you know, if they got in-store reservations going on, try and get them that way. And uh, yeah, you know, hopefully you guys have good success with getting this release because the shoe will be worth it to get and it definitely can make you some money. And if you just want a pair to wear, you know, I, I, I understand that too, but I feel bad for anybody that wears, you know, a size 11. That's, that's tough. You can't get this shoe, you know, especially if you want the release. I just, uh, that's ultra tough. But yeah, aside from that, uh, you know, that's really everything I got to say right there. So everything that's important will be linked in the description. You guys can go check it all down there. All the raffles, foot sites, my, you know, how to make multiple accounts and sneakers video right there. And don't forget to ask any questions you have down below in the comments. I don't answer them there for you all. But if you guys want, you know, again, follow me on Instagrams down below. Those will be in the description. Uh, you can subscribe and like if you want to again, too. Again, if this video helped you out, you know, again, uh, we do plenty of how to cop uh, videos on, here on the channel. Uh, got a really big video coming tomorrow, so stay tuned for that. That'll be, you know, uh, pretty actually, I'm pretty excited to uh, present that video. You know, it's just kind of showing basically what I've been working on uh, instead of reselling for the last, like, I mean, like six months or so, I guess, you know, so pretty much last half year. Yeah, you know, that's everything I got to say. So yeah, like goal, 200 likes if, all, if we want to hit it. But again, it's not the end of the world if we don't. And leave, again, any of your questions down below. And if you're still watching the video right now, comment, 
just comment Dior. Just comment Dior, because, like, you know, it's just it's the first thing I saw. I just had it laying right there. Um, just kind of in my view. But, yeah, that's everything i got to say right there. So, I'm going to end the screen recording. Don't know why I really had that still going right there. But, uh, yeah, kind of a different camera angle here. But we're going to figure out a better camera angle. I'm going to go watch some uh, older videos when I was back at the house. Uh, or I'll just kind of figure out a camera angle that works. That's, a side, uh, you know, different from this one. But, yeah, back at the room. So, I'm happy about that. But a little bit long of an outro. So, I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.